Yawns. Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. It, oh gosh, what day is, oh no, it's a Monday. Oh my gosh, how can I forget that it's literally a Monday? Uh, not the funnest of days of the week, but it's a fun day for me because yesterday Clay and I got a dog. Oh my gosh. Well, the puppy, he's so cute. Um, but I'm heading to PetSmart right now. I'll explain the whole story about how we got him after I get home because this is the first time I've left him home alone in his crate. So it's breaking my little heart that he's squealing in there. And we named him Charlie. And so I'm gonna go and get Charlie um, a little tag for his, his a collar um, and probably some toys and some treats. So we're gonna go to PetSmart and have a little bit of fun and I'm gonna come back and play with him. Time to head into PetSmart for the first time. Y'all, I've literally only ever been here for like a friend. <laughs> Moving to the next stop. All right, so since I didn't take y'all in the stores with me, I figured I'd show you real quickly what I got for little Mr. Charlie. Um, so I went in Marshalls because I knew they had really good bowl sets and also a few other things that I probably want to get. So this is going to be hard to show you guys but this is his little food and water bowl set. We already had a metal bowl from my parents, um, but he was not really taken to it for some reason. So I went ahead and gotten these anyway, so they match. One says, feed me, and one says, thirsty. It's down there at the bottom. So freaking cute. I think this is like maybe $13. Um, then we got him a little container to put his food in, and then inside there, there's a little mat that we're gonna put under his food bowls. If I can get it out, it looks like this. It says, love my dog, and it's so cute. And really like the color of it as well. Then from PetSmart, okay, first off, I totally forgot to get his tag, so I have to go back and do that. Um, I got a scoop for his food, because we didn't have one of those. Um, I got him a little Kong, because we got him a big one, um, but I figure maybe the little one will be easier for him, so we can put some treats in it while he's still small got this little guy because he loves my roommate's toys, uh, dog's toys that make this crunchy noise. So got him that. Got him a little tug of war thing because he has been loving tug of war, playing with me. We got, oops, the Better Apple Spray. This is really good for spraying on furniture and things you don't want the dogs to chew on. And he's definitely teething and been chewing on shoes and stuff. So gonna make sure he won't do that anymore. Got him some little jacks. Um, these are just little little snackities good for training him whenever he's a little older and we got this flavor as well and let's see what else is this oh these are gonna be coming in handy because he has such bad puppy breath right now these are the little dental stick things and then lastly I got him this little chew bone so Mr. Charlie is going to be a super duper spoiled today when I get home and I'm really excited about it but now I've got to go back to PetSmart and go and get his tag made because I totally forgot to and I'm gonna go home and play with my little boy and we're gonna chill out until I have to go to work later which is gonna be so sad because I don't want to leave him because it breaks my heart but you know you gotta get him trained you gotta get him used to the crate and all that good stuff but I'm excited so I'm gonna go and get his tag and hopefully it won't take that long and then I can go back and surprise him with all the goodies Little baby Charlie sleeping on the couch. He's so tired. Him and Stella have been playing all day long. Oh no, Stella. Ah, uh -uh. Stella, down, down. So I went ahead and set up his little food bowl with his little mat that I got. Put his little food container and shovel, spoon, whatever. Stella's is right here next to him, so they'll be all cute next to each other. This is a little look at the side of the bowls. So they say thirsty and feed me. Super cute, and this is love my dog. And then, let's turn the light on so y'all can see. In here is where I just temporarily put some of his things so that they're all kind of in one place. I went ahead and put some of this bitter apple spray. This is really good so dogs don't chew on furniture or shoes or anything. I sprayed that on my shoes and the living room furniture. It seems to be working pretty well. I've got all his little snacks over here, some of his little chew toys and stuff. I'm trying to keep them up and out of the way. I really just need to go and get like a little bin for them. Um, but I'm trying to keep all his things kind of over here off to the side because Stella's got her little basket of toys here. And so I'm trying to keep them 
separated so they at least know that their toys are. But they've been enjoying this little guy, which we got him. And they also got this little tug of war dude, so they've been playing a lot with it. You've been having fun, Stella? Stella's been such a big cousin, haven't you? You've been playing with him all day. Sadly though, I'm gonna have to head to work soon. Um, I have to be there at two, which means I leave at 1.30. And we are working on crate training him, so he'll be in the crate by himself like a big boy for a while. And my roommate Sam, she said that he did a really good job. He only really whined for like a minute after we left earlier. So I'm hoping that'll still be the case and that he will just be upset for a little while and then he'll kind of get over it and then he'll calm down and relax and he won't be freaking out anymore. But my roommates are gonna come and let him out um, whenever I'm at work, because I'll be there from two to five, so I'll be back around 5.30, and Clay, that's what time he'll get back from work too. Um, so they're just gonna let him out around like three o'clock or so. He's such a sleepy boy, he's so cute. Oh, uh, but I wanted to talk about how we actually found him, how we got him. So yesterday, which was Sunday, Clay and I were driving home to see my parents, and I live about an hour away from here in a smaller town, and we live in a city now, so, um, going home to my family is like there are a lot of back roads and things like that so clay and i were heading home and we drove across this bridge and i looked down to my right where there's like a little river pond area and i see this little puppy just dash across a little muddy area and so i said clay i just saw a puppy and then he said okay we'll, we'll turn around we'll go and look at it i was so surprised i was like really we're gonna go get him oh my gosh so we walked down there and I was really nervous we weren't gonna find him and he was gonna be gone already because I saw him running and I was nervous that he was like running into the woods or something near there so I got really scared. Um, but Clay and I drove down there and the whole area was super duper muddy so we had to park the car and like walk over to the other side of the bridge where he was at and as soon as we walked over there it, he was not shy at all he started running up to clay he was so happy looking and we found that he was left with a towel and some dog food and it looked like someone had left him on the side of the road unfortunately and it breaks my heart because i don't even know what kind of person could do something to an animal like that um it bre breaks my heart it truly does but I am so thankful we found Charlie. Um, I'm, I can literally cry talking about him because he is the cutest and sweetest little boy ever. And I'm so happy we found him because God only knows what would have happened. Um, as Clay and I were leaving, we actually ran into um, a group of bikers, two ladies and two men, and they said that they had seen a car uh, driving off from down there and there's a little puppy running after it so we ended up telling them that yeah we got the puppy and he's going with us and he'll be safe and uh, they were coming to check on him too so I think that he would have been found and well taken care of regardless but I am extremely happy and so blessed that we found such a cute little sweetheart and he's already taken both Clay and I so well he loves us to death he'll just curl up on your chest and sleep or take little naps he's just as happy as could be and i'm so thrilled that we could give him such a good home somewhere he'll be happy safe and healthy but we're very blessed that my mom works at a vet so and my whole family is just full of dog lovers and we all we all everyone it seems has dogs so um we were really really excited that you know, my mom's gonna be able to take him into the vet and really make sure that he's clean, he's well taken care of, he's got his shots, and he's gonna be nice and healthy. We're so blessed that, I mean, I, we were just, everybody was so helpful yesterday. My mom pretty much had everything that we really needed to get started. Uh, all we really had to buy yesterday was some puppy food and some treats for him, um, and then whatever toys we really wanted, so. We were really excited about that. So he's got a crate, he's got a bed, he's got some shampoo so he was all clean. We gave him a first bath last night. Um, he has some toys now, we got him lots of treats. He has his food bowls and he's got Stella here, my roommate's dog, which is, she's literally down here playing with me. But you know, we're excited that he's gonna have a lot of friends to play with. He's gonna have a healthy and a happy home 
he's been doing so well last night he slept throughout the whole night and I'm just so excited to have him here. I'm so pumped. I think it's gonna be really fun. Clay and I were planning on actually getting a dog probably in a few more months, um, but I guess this is just a sign that we were meant to have this little man. You know, he's over here napping and he's so cute, y'all. So this is Charlie. Oh goodness, big yawns, Charlie. Oh, big yawn, Charlie, huh? And Stella loves him. They've been hanging out a lot and playing. Playing with each other. Are you a sleepy boy, Charlie? Are you a sleepy boy? I know you are. You had such a long day, huh? What's up, guys? It's later. I'm chilling in my car because I'm about to head into work. I just wanted to give you guys a little update. My heart is breaking because I had to leave my little baby in the crate and I hate having to leave him there. I hope he's not sad and I hope he does well. But I, I don't know. I just wanted to update you guys to let you know I'm going to work. I don't know if I'll vlog while I'm there or not. Maybe. We'll see. And uh, if I don't, I will see you guys after work. The life of a nanny. <laughs> Curious George, little one there, and a little one here. Baby Bo. Hi, baby Bo. Hello, sweetheart. Hey guys, so obviously I am in different clothes and in a different location. I'm currently at my parents' house right now. I took little baby Charlie to the vet for the first time today and he did so well. He's all healthy and happy. So I went over to my parents' house and I'm waiting for my mom to get off work and then I'm just gonna hang out with her for a little while. So I thought I would come here and relax. I got little baby Charlie here. He's napping because he got his baby shot. So he's all tired and stuff. Poor Grizz. 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 Grizz keeps wanting to play with him but Charlie's just so tired. Grizz is a golden retriever for anyone wondering. I did a whole vlog on him. He's such a funny cow look. Grizz, Charlie's sleeping bud. We got Grizz here. He's hanging out with us for the day and chilling. These are my, um, this is my parents' dog. Little man sleeps a lot. So I'm just hanging out here until my mom gets off work. Once she is here, we're just gonna chill out with each other for a little while. Um, I thought it would be fun for the dogs to get to play with each other and to just come and see my mom for a little bit. Right now I'm watching, I think another Cinderella story is what it's called. Um, the one with Selena Gomez. I know it's pretty darn good. So we're going to do that and I'm just going to chill. I'll update you guys if I do anything fun. Hey guys. Um, sorry for my crazy hair first off. Um, it is now... Wednesday and I realized I didn't close off the vlog so I am closing off the vlog I really hope you guys enjoyed getting a chance to meet my new little puppy You probably hear him running around right now And they ran into me the dogs ran into me Aren't they freaking cute? I love them. Love them. Love Charlie already. He's so sweet But I hope you guys enjoyed the chance of meeting my new a little puppy Charlie Clay and I are so thrilled that we were able to rescue him and he is now our precious little boy and I'm just so excited for all the memories and the fun that he's gonna have and how happy he's gonna be here in our home so I'm just really really excited but I wanted to end the vlog and just say I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you all in my next vlog bye guys